devotees compassion an essential subject from the Nipedia the Lord has given such a wonderful gift to all living beings to help them become free from the bondage of birth and death his devotees devotees of the Lord are so compassion toward the suffering souls there is no comparison to their compassionate nature they cannot tolerate seeing any part and parcel of the Lord's suffering if we want to forget Krishna or God the Lord being so merciful fulfills that desire he gives us the facilities to make us forget him but the devotees of Krishna or God are very compassionate towards the living entities. They are always thinking of how to help the distressed souls. Therefore they preach Krishna consciousness or God consciousness to the world. They know that the only way to end this suffering is the process of Krishna consciousness. Srila Prabhupada's books, lectures, conversations and letters offer a comprehensive presentation of this essential subject as seen in the Vinikot's devotees compassion category. An introduction from his books is given below in the following 15 quotes. Quotes from Srila Prabhupada's books The devotees are actually saintly persons or estus. The first qualification of estu or devotee is aes or non-violence. Estu is described as titik avakaruik sb 3.25.21. A devotee should be tolerant and should be very much compassionate toward others. For example, if he suffers personal injury, he should tolerate it, but if someone else suffers injury, the devotee need not tolerate it. The whole world is full of violence, and a devotee's first business is to stop this violence, including the unnecessary slaughter of animals. Our Mad BH Gavadam 4.22, 24, Praldama Arya is the topmost example of a Vaiva, who is always compassionate towards sinful persons suffering a hellish life within this material world. Krishna is therefore known as Paradukadu KHK Pimbadi, or one who is compassionate toward other suffering and who is an ocean of mercy. Like Praldama Arya, all pure devotees of the Lord come to this material world with full compassion to deliver the sinful. They undergo all kinds of tribulations, suffering them with tolerance, because that is another qualification of a Vaiva, who tries to deliver all sinful persons from the hellish conditions of material existence. Our Mad BH Gavadam 4.21, 47, and Siriya does not exploit his followers. Since the Siriya is a confidential servitor of the Lord, his heart is always full of compassion for humanity and its suffering. He knows that all suffering is due to the absence of devotional service to the Lord, and therefore he always tries to find ways to change people's activities, making them favorable for the attainment of devotion. Kaitanya Karatam Ta, DLL 3.98, Praldama Arya said, My Lord, I have no personal problems, for I have learned how to glorify your transcendental qualities and thus enter a trance of ecstasy. I do have a problem, however, for I am simply thinking of these rascals and fools who are busy with them why sukha, temporary happiness, without knowledge of devotional service unto you. This is the problem faced by a Vaiva. Because Avayeva fully takes shelter of the Supreme Personality of Godhead, he personally has no problems, but because he is compassionate toward the fallen, conditioned souls, he is always thinking of plans to save them from their hellish life in this body and the next. Our Mad BH Gavadam 6.1 6. Sometimes religious men who preach the Krishna consciousness movement for the benefit of the entire populace are arrested and harassed by the police and courts. The Vyadtas, who are Vyavas, lamented for these very regrettable facts. Because of their spiritual compassion for all the fallen souls, Vyavas go out to preach according to the standard method of all religious principles, but unfortunately, because of the influence of Kali Yuga, Vyavas who have dedicated their lives to preaching the glories of the Lord are sometimes harassed and punished by courts on false charges of disturbing the peace. Our Mad BH Gavadam 6.2 2. The devotees of the Lord understand that it is M.Y.'s influence that has spoiled the people and made them demoniac. Thus the inherently noble disposition of the devotees leads them to think only of the demon's benefit without a tinge of envy. The devotees are therefore known as Patita Pivana, the saviors of the fallen. In fact, the devotees are more compassionate than the Supreme Lord himself. Of course, it is the Supreme Lord's grace alone that makes them more compassionate than the Lord. And by the mercy of such devotees, the lowest sinful men and women can attain the lotus feet of the Lord. Renunciation through Wisdom, Chapter 2.3, Rn Radhai, being the best amongst the Vyavas, is compassionate towards such unfortunate victims of worthless literatures, and thus he advises our Vaisadeva to compose transcendental literature which is not only attractive but can also actually bring liberation from all kinds of bondage. 
our mad bh ka bottom 1.5 13 by studying all the vedas one should come to understand the transcendental position of lord r krishna one who actually assimilated the essence of the vedas can preach the truth he is compassionate to conditioned souls who are suffering the threefold miseries of this conditional world due to their not being Krishna conscious. Our Mad BH Gavatam 5.5 24 Only a viable leader can fulfill all the desires of the people, VCH Kalpataru, and he is compassionate because he is the contributor of the greatest benefit to human society. He is Patita Pivana, the deliverer of all fallen souls, because if the king or the head of the government follows in the footsteps of the Biarhmas and Vyavas, who are naturally leaders in missionary work, the Vyas will also follow in the footsteps of the Vyavas and Biarhmas, and the Dras will give them service. Our Mad BH Gavatam 4.21 50. Parkeet Maharya was astonished that the living entities in the conditional stage do not accept the path of liberation, devotional service, instead of suffering in so many hellish conditions. This is the symptom of Avayava. Vch Kalpatrabya ka kp sindhubya eva ka. Avayava is an ocean of mercy. Paraduka du kh. He is unhappy because of the unhappiness of others. Therefore Parkeet Maharya, being compassionate toward the conditioned soul suffering in hellish life, suggested that UK Devagasvam continue describing the path of liberation, which he had explained in the beginning of our Mad BH Gavadam. Our Mad BH Gavadam 6.1. 1. Pralda Maharya was a Vyava. He did not ask a benediction for his personal self but was very affectionate toward his father. Although his father tortured him and would have killed him had he himself not been killed by the Supreme Personality of Godhead, Praldama Arya begged pardon for him from the Lord. This favor was immediately granted by the Lord, and here Yakapu was delivered from the darkest region of hellish life, and he returned back home, back to Godhead, by the grace of his son. Praldama Arya is the topmost example of a Vyava, who is always compassionate toward sinful persons suffering a hellish life within this material world. Our Mad BH Gavadam 4.21. 47. A devotee travels all over the country, from door to door, preaching, be Krishna conscious. Be a devotee of Lord Krishna. Don't spoil your life in simply fulfilling your animal propensities. Human life is meant for self-realization, or Krishna consciousness. These are the preachings of Astu. He is not satisfied with his own liberation. He always thinks about others. He is the most compassionate personality towards all the fallen souls. One of his qualifications, therefore, is Kairuika, great mercy to the fallen souls. Our Mad BH Gavadam 3.25. 21. Whenever there is disease in any part of the body, the whole body takes care of the ailing part. Similarly, a devotee's oneness is manifested in his compassion for all conditioned souls. Bhagavad GT 5.18 says, Paitsama Dharina. Those who are learned see everyone's conditional life equally. Devotees are compassionate to every conditioned soul, and therefore they are known as Aprakya Bhuti. Because devotees are learned and know that every living entity is part and parcel of the Supreme Lord, they preach Krishna consciousness to everyone so that everyone may be happy. Our Mad BH Gavadam 4.7, 53, and Siriya does not exploit his followers. Since the Siriya is a confidential servitor of the Lord, his heart is always full of compassion for humanity in its suffering. He knows that all suffering is due to the absence of devotional service to the Lord, and therefore he always tries to find ways to change people's activities, making them favorable for the attainment of devotion. That is the qualification of an Siriya. Although Aradta Prabhu himself was powerful enough to do the work, as a submissive servitor he thought that without the personal appearance of the Lord, no one could improve the fallen condition of society. Kaitanya Karatam Ta, DLL 3.98, Vyavas are generally very compassionate toward the conditioned souls. Without even being invited, a devotee will go from door to door to enlighten people, to bring them out of the darkness of nescience by imparting knowledge of the living entity's constitutional position as a servant of Lord Krishna. Such devotees are empowered by the Lord to distribute devotional consciousness, or Krishna consciousness, to the people in general. They are known as authorized spiritual masters, and it is by the mercy of such a spiritual master that a conditioned soul gets the seed of devotional service. Teachings of Lord Kaitanya, Chapter 1